right, hola. This is for those who like short videos. I'm going to play a short clip from this fella here. Well, often we like to consider that um, Satan is this big, uh, scary thing, which he is for us. Satan is very big, very scary. We, sh we should not uh, tempt him, but... He says Satan is big and scary and we should not tempt him. Is that what the Bible says? So let's do this here first of all. Tempt Satan. Should we not tempt Satan? Let's see here. Um, here we have Jesus in the wilderness for 40 days tempted of Satan. In 1 Corinthians 7, that Satan tempt you not for your incontinency. So there's no mention here of, hey, don't tempt Satan. All right, so what about the devil? All right, here again, the spirit into the wilderness, talking about Jesus to be tempted of the devil. All right, so the devil is tempting Jesus. No mention at all of the devil or Satan. Uh, no mention at all of us you know, don't tempt Satan, don't tempt the devil. There's no mention of that whatsoever. It's the devil that is tempting us, all right? That's important to understand. Now, what about this here? What if we did this? Tempt the Lord God. Deuteronomy 6, verse 16. Ye shall not tempt the Lord your God. Think about what he said here scary thing which he is for us satan is very big very scary we, sh we should not uh, tempt him we should not tempt him yet the law says that we should not tempt the lord pastor randy smith says we should not tempt satan think about that in matthew 4 verse 7 jesus said unto him it is written again Thou shalt not tempt the Lord thy God. What's Randy Smith say? Scary thing, which he is for us. Satan is very big, very scary. We, sh we should not uh, tempt him, but... But you're ignorant. You're wrong. You have no knowledge or understanding of the scripture whatsoever. You have no business at all teaching the Bible. None whatsoever. 